My name is Connor David Ashley Brown. When I was just seven years old, I had a terrible accident that changed the way I saw the world. If I could describe what life was like before the accident, I could probably guess it was boring, colourless. A bit like an old school 1950s black and white movie. I was on a family holiday in Spain. I think it was Lanzarote. We were all chilling by the pool and uh, I decided to show off just like kids do. I went to do a backflip into the deep end of the swimming pool and unfortunately I missed the water and took a big knock to the head. When I eventually woke up, I developed synaphasia. It changed the way I viewed colours in a different way to other people. I see them more vividly. Everything I see around me is related to a different colour. The colours I see and the, the things I see relate to different feelings and emotions. For instance, when I listen to music, it instantly produces a colourful light inside my mind. It lets me know if I like it or not, depending on the song. Like when I listen to reggae, my world turns red. It makes me feel happy inside and everything seems okay. But if I listen to something I don't like, my world turns blue. And everything seems sad and kind of depressing. It also affected the way I perceived the days of the week and the months of the year. For instance, to me, May is the colour green and September is the colour yellow. When I look at the calendar month, it produces an S shape that I never used to get before the accident. I also forgot how to tell the time because all these new colours were vivid and strange to me. It also affects the way I see people around me, depending on the emotion they bring and the relationship I have. The people I don't know I perceive as white, but the people I do know, like my best friends and my closest family, I perceive as dark blue. When I first developed synaphasia, it was a major problem for me. The vivid colours overpowered the way I was able to process things in my mind. Just like when I forgot how to tell the time. I had to retake lessons after school just to be able to tell the time again. But I'm used to it now. It's more of a benefit, if anything. Life's more vivid, music's more colourful. I've got a better memory of numbers and letters because of it. It's a great advantage in maths as well. Sometimes I mix up my lefts and rights, but that's okay. It makes me who I am. Nowadays, I couldn't imagine living life in any other way.